to share with you some journals that I've made. Um, these are Traveller's Notebook size journals. They're all decorated. Um, they all measure eight and a quarter by four and a half. They have one signature in each and there is 96 pages front and back in each one. These will all be listed in my shop if you're interested and the link will be below. So I will start with, I've named them all as well. This one's Journey, this one's Adventure and this one is Memories. And let's start with Journey. So I've used um, this pattern cardstock which I've sewn onto some uh, coffee dyed cardstock so it's nice and it's got a nice thick cover. Um, I've done some layering, music paper, some scraps. This is from my porch prints. So I just have to glue that little bit down. Put some pearl um, beaded string thing. Beaded string, beaded, beaded pearls. <laughs> uh, there's a butterfly there with um, a pearl center and obviously the word journal. Um, we have eyelets and uh, what do you call this stuff? String. <laughs> I haven't done a video in a while. <laughs> um, so like I said, the inside is just uh, coffee dyed cardstock and it's been sewn. Uh, the papers in this one are from Tsunami Rose and it is the Charming Fragments. So here we just have some layering here, there's a pocket, some stamping. I've done some stenciling on these coffee dyed tags. This is from Artie Mays. Uh, just a tag that I stenciled and inked up. Little flip down. This is an idea from Clemmy, and Clemmy is um, listed below as well. So that goes in there. This image is from Tsunami Rose. There is a doily, some corner punching, paper bag. This is from Tsunami Rose as well. Just made a little layered tag there. And this is an envelope. Can't remember who that's from, but it's an Etsy seller. And that just pops in there. There's some lined paper, there's some crocheted fabric tabs. Here we just have a Terry Woods double pocket flip out. Doily, some scrap pieces here and a butterfly. Got another tag which just pops in there. The other journals are just very similar to this. We have this tag that is from um, Dreams Etc. This is from Tsunami Rose. Yeah, so the other ones I'll just do a quick flip on. <clears throat> some Edith Holden. This is from Tsunami Rose. Flip up here, this is Rita Donnelly. Um, flip up and I've linked her below as well. A tag. <clears throat> some ephemera. Tag and a journal card there. Another crocheted fabric tab. Um, a paper bag. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, this is from the old design shop. Here we just have one of the trifoldy things and it's stamped. And this is just a journal card. Center of the signature. I love the coffee dine or tea dine in this. Just some ephemera. Paper bag. Another Rita Donnelly flip here. And then inside here we just have stenciled tag and a stamped tag and a library card. Got a pocket here, that's the other side of the Edith Holden. Here is um, another Terry Woods double pocket flip out. You've got all that a space to journal, and here we just have another uh, library card, a tag, and a piece of ephemera. And that's just paper clipped closed there. 
And now this is uh, from Tsunami Rose. And then we just have one of these, and that's from the old design shop. So there's lots of places to journal <coughs> and journal on. Another tag, two tags here, and that's just a little folded up journal card. And then we've just got some layering on here. So that is Journey. And this one is Adventure. Again, it's all kind of the same concept as the other one. Just different pages and different cover. This, uh, the main pages in this one is from My Porch Prints. I just bought um, another kit to play with which is from My Porch Prints and it's called, I think it's Grandma's Closet I think it's called and oh my gosh it's so pretty, it's all printed out, it's all coffee dyed <clears throat> and tomorrow that will be my mission that's another Terry Woods double pocket flip out little folded journal card Another journal card here, tag, and ephemera. Yeah, so I'm really looking forward to having a play with um, the grandma, Grandma's Closet journal kit. A Rita Donnelly flip, some more tags and ephemera. Some stamping on the back there. Crochet tab. The other side of the paper bag. Another Rita Donnelly flip. I do love these pages. Edith Holden. Another, that's one of them flip downs and you can write inside it. Some more ephemera, a tag and a library card. Another one of these jars, it's got hummingbirds on it. That is from the old design shop. Here. And that is that one. So that is adventure. And then we have memories. Again, all the same kind of concept as the other ones. Uh, this paper here is from Ephemois. Here we just have journal card, that's one of them flip down things, a tag and a stencil to tag. <clears throat> that doesn't want to go in. There we go. A doily, some corner punching, another one of these tags, another one of those envelopes like in the first one. Another um, Terry Woods double pocket flip out page and see if I can get that in. There we go. Oh, put it in the wrong bit. When you make these, <clears throat> you've obviously got um, like two little folds there. So when you put things in, you want to try and get it there, otherwise it will fall right through the bottom. Donnelly glued flip. <laughs> there we go. These little tickets that I use, they're from Tsunami Rose as well. Um, I 
kind of a tri fold. <coughs> Excuse me. So, like I said, they're all very much the same. Um, and they will all be listed in my shop. I also have put up um, a few made-to-order made journals from the big chunky blank ones that I was doing the other day because um, I was asked, well a lot of people have said oh when they went over obviously they were gone. Um, so I've put a few more up as I say they are made to order, can't get that in there, there we go. Um, but I'm only having them listed until Friday and then I'm taking them off. So I don't want to. Um, I don't want to have to to do them like you know all the time. I'm made to orders. I just do it every now and again. If that makes sense. I know what I'm thinking in my head. <laughs> um, yeah, just every now and again I'll put up a made to order but I only keep them on there for a short time and if they don't sell well they don't sell then I don't have to make them <laughs> I do it when I've got the time that's probably a better explanation so there we go there is all the journals and did I get that done I did get that done in good time um, <clears throat> so that is them and I have to glue that little piece down there so I will put everyone's links below as well um, and a link to my shop. If you have any questions, just ask and thanks for watching. Bye.